So Grant, tell us about the game. Well today's game was uh, in Derby City Dragons playing Telford Raiders. The first time Derby City Dragons have actually reached the grand final. Uh, really it's a testament to the lads to get this far. I uh, haven't played most of our games in the league away from home. I actually get back and has them for the final. I thought it was a really hard fought match. Uh, considering these lads have only been playing together really for three months, uh, it was a testament to their, their courage, fit, fitness, and uh, putting into execution what we've done. And a lot of them are actually under 13s age groups, so they'll be able to come back next year. Yeah, 60% of the team today were uh, under 13s. Uh, and the majority of the under-14s were actually the first season at Rugby League. So, a great combination, uh, culminating in a, a showing in the final. So, first class really for the lads. So Grant, you've been coaching now at Derby City for the last season. Can you explain to us a little bit about what support the RFL have given you to, to you in that role? Well, the, the support from RFL has been absolutely first class. Uh, having done the Level 1 course, which in itself was uh, a must-do really if you're coming into coaching Rugby League, despite having four years coaching experience at Union, that is a must-do if you're doing Rugby League. Uh, communication from the guys at RFL, uh, Darren and, and Martin, any questions I've had, I've had an email back within 24 hours, always willing to help. Uh, resources that I've had available have been absolutely first class. So I can't fault it. The guys are doing a really good job, really good support.